Yo, it's Don from Mount Pena. I'm getting interrogated by Miraculous. Where are you from? From La Puente, California. How old are you? 19, um, turning 20, December. What's your ethnicity? I'm Mexican. What were you like growing up? I was a good kid. Like, never really caused too much trouble and shit, but I mean, never passed no fucking class. You feel me? Overall, shit, I was just a good little nigga. You feel me? Respect. You feel me? I always have respect. You feel me? I was a good little Did you expect to be in the position you are in today? No, shit, I didn't even think I was gonna do this music. I used to have hoop dreams. You know, I used to want to go to the NBA and shit, but I mean, that shit ain't go too far. Stop doing that shit. Who's your favorite NBA team? Clippers. I'm an oddball. You feel me? Everyone's a Laker fan, but you know what I mean? I'm a Clipper fan. Have you worked a regular job? Yeah, one time. Um, me and my two cousins and shit, we worked for this um, moving company. That shit didn't last long though. I stopped going for like two weeks. Why? Was there something that happened at the job? No. Nah, no, no, it's just I couldn't get up early, but I love seeing the green, you feel me? And that shit don't even pay too good. When will you know that you made it? When I got my feet kicked up and looking down at everybody. Oh, when my mama's in a mansion, I went and go to Bora Bora, you feel me? Something like that. What type of music do you listen to? Trap, underground, a little dirt, young boy, you feel me? But I, I like to listen um, to my own music too, but I like to listen to music that no one really knows, you feel me? So when you play that shit and that shit's bumping in the car, gonna be like, oh, what's that shit called? I'm gonna be like, no, check, get your own music. Do you have any hobbies? Yeah, I guess you could say, uh, making music. What's your favorite type of food? Mexican, man, Mexican, for sure. Yeah, you can never go wrong with no Mexican food, you feel me? That shit's always gonna be good. What phone app do you use the most? Instagram. Yeah, I'm on my Instagram all day. I kind of f with the TikTok and shit, but mostly Instagram. That's where all my hours been going. What is something that you do every day? Eat, eat all day. Uh, either that, or if I ain't doing that, shit, Probably just listening to beats, rhyme music, you feel me? What inspires you? Myself, if that makes sense. Being the little nigga that I, that I am, you feel me? Coming from where I come from. I'm on a good little path, you feel me? Shit going smooth. What do you look for in a friendship? Loyalty. Loyalty. Fuck everything else, nigga. If you can be loyal, and I ain't gotta worry about nothing, you feel me? We gonna be green, we gonna, we gonna win for sure. Do you believe in astrology? Astrology as in like... Horoscopes. No. No, nigga, fuck, no, how you gonna tell me I'm a Sagittarius and, and you're a, a, a Gemini or a Libra or whatever the fuck we gonna get along, like, no, no, we ain't, you ain't gonna convince me, that if we mix, we mix, you feel me, not just cause you're a Libra and I'm a Sagittarius, you know? What is the craziest or scariest moment in your life? Um, I don't say I was scared, but I mean, shit was crazy, you feel me, but we gonna keep that to ourselves. Where do you see yourself in five years? Five years? Um, I see myself either in a sky rise, looking down, or the side of the hill, nigga, looking down, fat ass house, you feel me? Money long, nigga, ain't worried about driving a motherfucking foreign, you feel me? What kind of car? If I'm up, up, nigga, for surely a Rolls Royce, but money smooth and everything, then I'll pay, I want to aim for like a little Benz or something, like a, like a S550, I'll make back. If money wasn't an object, what would you do? I don't know, that's a good question. Probably jacking that. That's what you'd do if, if money didn't like, wasn't important you'd still be robbing people? Yeah, f it. <laughs> What's one thing that you'll never do again? Go down a mother hill on a skateboard. No, I ain't never doing that shit again, bro. What happened? I'm going down this long ass steep ass hill in, in f***ing West Covina at the f***ing BLD, you feel me? If you know, you know. I was going down there, I caught the speed wobbles and lost control. I, I tried to jump off my board because it's like a cliff. If it, I'm going fast as f***. If I don't stop, I'm gonna fly, fly over the mother cliff. So, I mean, I got scared, you feel me? So I try to jump off and run it out, but I'm going like 20 miles an hour, you know? So, right when I jump off, my feet hit the ground and they just skip right off. And I fall on my shoulder and I'm just scraping down the hill. I was all bloody and scraped up, man. That shit was hurt. That shit probably one of the worst pains I ever went through. I ain't never doing that shit again, though. Have you ever broken any bones? Nah, never. Nah, I don't want to. I on you know, my, my knuckle, though. That shit dislocated. It's like in the middle of my hand. I sucked in his head, but I didn't squeeze my hand all the way. My shit's like right here. Who are some of your favorite artists? Myself. I f with AFM Peso. Recently I've been f with the Dirk, Young Boy. I know it's kind of crazy, Dirk and Young Boy. I said that, but hey, nigga, I f with both of them. But, um, oh, and I f with Lil Pete too. Lil Pete Hart. What's something that you haven't experienced but you want to experience before you die? Make a million. So I can say, like, yeah, nigga, I did that, you know? What is the best compliment someone can give you? I f with your music. You gonna make it. You on the right path, you feel me? Motivating. What keeps you up at night? Man, I know it ain't good to think about or talk about, but I'll be like almost going to sleep and I'll just be like, man, what the f happened when you die? Bro, that's 
start scaring it. You feel me? Like, what the f really happened, bro? Like, no way. It's just dark. Like, you just blank. Like, no, something gotta happen, fool. But nigga, I ain't trying to find out. You think there's heaven and hell? I don't know. I believe in like, like resurrection. So you think we're born again? Yeah, for surely. I think, I think like when you die, um, you go live your life, like you watch your life over and you gotta relive that shit until you get it perfect, you feel me? So whenever you sin, like, oh, you already fucked up, nigga, when you die, you gonna have to do it again, you feel me? So you live a perfect life. How did you come up with your name? Uh, kind of uh, self-explanatory, you feel me? My name's Dom, what Dom me, you feel me? Everyone call me Dom, um, and I'm from La Puente, you feel me? LP. What inspired you to get into music? I kind of um, always f with it, like, I always wanted to know, like, what the f I sounded like on the beat, you feel me? I would always write these little raps and sh spit them to the homies and sh and one day the homie, we was in art class and sh at, at our continuation school, and one day the homie was like, here, put the earphones in. I put him in, he had the beat playing, he was like, just rap, just rap, you feel me? So I, I was just rapping and sh but the whole time he was recording it. Yeah, next thing you know, the n ended up going home, throwing a little verse on it and, sh and f um, dropping that motherfucker on SoundCloud and he was with it, so I was like, you think I'm about to do this shit again, you feel me? I'm about to, I'm about to uh, continue this shit and shit ever since then, it just ran, ran with that motherfucker. How old were you when that happened? Uh, I was probably like 17, 16. It was my junior year. Art class, Mr. Madden, the Valley High School. Whoa, shout out you. How did you come up with the rap style? I guess it kind of like came to me, like, I don't know. I guess it's, a, it's probably just like being a Kelly, you feel me? The type of music I listen, I listen to. What makes a song worthy of putting out? Oh, that shit knocking fool i gotta like feel some some type of way about it you feel me like if i keep replaying that mother over and over and over again after the studio and i know for surely like yeah this the one dude. like i gotta i gotta drop this month who's an artist that you want to work with afn peso like i said Lil pete dead or alive anybody anybody tupac nigga that legendary what snoop like Lil snoop oh little snoop I well, you said Snoop, like Snoop's alive. No, I'm talking about Snoop Dogg. Yeah, you said that. Oh, okay. No, I was kind of <laughs> going through, you feel me? But hey, little Snoop too. When times are tough, what keeps you motivated? The chili. Looking at my progression. Just focusing on the bigger picture, you know? Have you ever been recognized before? Yeah. Every time I go to West Covina Mall, niggas want to take pictures. How did it feel when you first got recognized? Psh, that shit was crazy. Well, I was just chilling outside um, the Zoomies and shit at West Covina Mall. And I see like two little niggas um, across the way. They just kept looking at me. So I was just like, you feel me? Like, what are these niggas looking at, you know? And they start walking up. So I'm like, like what's up with these, you know? And they were like, oh, bro, not for my P.I. It's your music. Gotta, gotta, gotta. Can I get a pick? I'm like, what? Nigga, you wanna pick me? Nigga, let's get it, you know? I was hyped. But ever since then, um, when someone asked me for a pick, nigga, that shit made me feel good, you know? How many tattoos do you have? Six. I'm about to do the whole body, though. What was your most painful tattoo? <laughs> this one. My Devil in the back of my head. The back of the head, bro, that shit's killer, nigga. I never wanted to do it again, but I did it just a few days ago. Let me see it. This one? Yeah. That shit hurt, bro. Like six, seven hours. Where could they find you on social media? Um, Dom from LP on uh, everything. On my Instagram, it's Dom from LP, but in the front, it's no O. You feel me? I lost my other account. But yeah, we rocking with that one for right now. Alright man, that's it, you feel me? Thank y'all for watching the video. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure you hit the like button, you feel me? Comment, subscribe, you feel me? Share the fuck out this month. It's down from LP, man, and I'm out of here.